So I went ahead and found out on my stats on YouTube that uh, no one comes here for the giveaway. So what I decided to do is just put the giveaway in the very back where no one probably watches it. So, nah, I'm just playing with y'all. Uh, here's the giveaway. So the first person that gets picked, you'll have dibs on all the items I'm giving. I'm giving away three things today. I'm giving away the wet paint. I'm giving away an orange painted finnick. And I'm giving away a solar flare. Okay, uh, just make sure your, your name is there. I went ahead and updated this time. I'm not going to make the same mistake twice. Maybe in a year from now I will. Alright, first one. El Destructor 03. Second. New Pluto. And my third winner. Swarm. Alright, congratulations to my winners. Hey, what is up, YouTube? This is Redicar200. So, welcome to a key to Heatwave. We got episode number three. I promise you, on this video, we have a, a lot more activity or a lot more uh, important activity that will be going on in order to get to our goal, which is Heatwave. Uh, congratulations to our winner. Uh, stay tuned, and maybe I'll be giving away something else on this video here. Okay, I do have a big giveaway coming up, so I do encourage you to subscribe, uh, hit the notification bell. Because uh, in some cases I might just give something away if you are the first one to comment. So uh, please stay tuned. Uh, thank you for all the support you've been giving me. I recently reached 500 subscribers. Very proud of that. Uh, I made a highlight video. I went ahead and made a Games and Crates uh, episode 8. So please check out my, my other videos. Okay, I am working towards my video about God. So stay tuned to that. I'm really excited about that one. Let's go ahead and get started with this video here. So the first thing I'm going to do is I want to give you a recap of where we're currently at. I do encourage you to watch episode one and then watch episode two, and then go ahead and uh, uh, go ahead and watch this video here, so that way you have a better idea of what we've what we've been doing and where we're at. I do have a good amount of items at this point, so because of that, I prefer just to join trading lobbies. So when we go into our lobby, we got to see exactly what we're trying to find here. So at the moment, I currently have uh, three non-crate very rares. So I prefer to just to save them up, gather two more non-crate very rares, and that would give me a total of five. And that would equal to two keys. So it's best just to save them up. And I do have the two player choice, uh, player choice imports. And that pretty much sums up a key. So I'm preferring to bundle it up because uh, that's not more retrieving. Maybe I could get an add-on with my keys. So let's go to get started. Uh, with my first trade here, all we're doing is just showing inventory to each other. I do see that he has the yellow lightning boost. Okay, that is a non-crate very rare. So, uh, I automatically say that that is what I want. I'm pretty excited at this point. If I do get that, that'd give me a total of four non-crate very rares. Okay, I'm willing to trade away uh, an import. No problem for me. And let's go ahead and just tack on something. And we'll go ahead and complete our very first trade here. Okay. So now I need one more non-crate very rare uh, to give me a total of five to give me my two keys. So going into this trade, this guy wants a mantis. I am looking for non-crate very rares. Okay. Luckily, I do find one. He does have the banner. Uh, the thing about the banner it looks really ugly. So because it's a banner, maybe I could ask for something else. Okay. Simple trade. Okay. I do want that that banner and go ahead and just tack on the the virtual wave import and we're done with this trade here. So in order to become a good trader, okay, we have to think of this in terms of business, okay? And I wanna definitely give this guy a, a shout out, okay? Because the items that I'm offering right now, the five non-crave very rares and the two uh, player choice imports, okay? That is straight up three keys, okay? And that's for everybody. But the difference between uh, those guys and this guy, okay? He's willing to add. And obviously, if you're willing to add, you're willing to go with him rather than the other guy. So he's pretty much beating the competition by, you know, throwing on a little extra. OK, so that's just good business. OK, if this guy was like the other guys, OK, he wouldn't stand out. So because he's different, I'm willing to go with this guy because he's willing to give me a little bit more for my buck. OK, and that's just great business. OK, so as well, in order to be a good trader, you got to have your, your dues that that give you certain things. OK and this guy would definitely be my guy 
if you know I wanted to sell away non crate very rares. Okay, so I definitely want to give this guy a shout out. Uh, Y Dream underscore ZZ. Okay, uh, go ahead and um, look for this guy if you have any non crate very rares. Okay, he's really understanding. He's also willing to to work with you, help you out, give you a little bit add on. Okay, this dude has so much stuff. Why not just help out, okay? Especially because you're helping him out by giving you by giving him the the stuff that you want. Plus, it's good it's good business, okay? It's good publicity, okay? You're gonna want to go with this dude because this dude's gonna hook you up, okay? You know, you could learn uh, a couple things from this guy, okay? And I'm um, hopefully you understand what I'm trying to explain to you. Look, I didn't even ask for ask for something else, and he's just trying to to help me out. So I appreciate that, okay? Uh, after the after the win. The trades, okay. I went ahead and, and told this guy. This guy, um, this was for a YouTube video, okay. I went ahead and uh, told him, and I think he kind of freaked out a little bit, okay, because uh, you know he didn't he didn't respond, uh, and then he just said hello YouTube. <laughs> so I thought the, I thought that was funny. I'll go ahead and cut the video so that way you see it. Okay, let's go ahead and move on to our next trade, okay. Uh, Y Dream underscore ZZ, okay. You're the man. Thank you. So my next trade is a very simple one. I do have a guy that wants a golden gift import. So all we're pretty much doing is just trading import for import. Okay, um, he does offer me a golden egg import. You gotta be careful with the golden egg because there are two versions of the golden egg. There's the older one and then there's a the newer one. You can't distinguish the two from each other. Okay, by, by pushing L3. Uh, so you're pretty much just taking a risk okay if it says golden egg it might be the old one it might be the new one okay i wish they would just coincide with each other um he offers me uh that import uh a go explosion okay and just some some taa uh crates and we're good to go an easy trade okay so my next trade okay we could definitely say one man's trash is another man's treasure okay because uh, I do find someone that does want the the titanium white invader wheels okay uh, he specifically wants the exotic okay I'm assuming he's a collector so he is offering me a key for that really happy about that I currently have three attack one more okay we're doing good business here okay I do like this because I do ask him if he could add on something and the funny thing about it look at the two items he adds on <laughs> You can't be mad at that. It, they are add-ons. I am offering you something extra, okay? So I just thought that was a little funny, but um, make sure you just kind of just keep everything. Um, you never know when anyone will, will definitely want it. All you gotta do is just find the right people that's willing to pay for you for your item, okay? Uh, there are collectors out there that do want specific colors for sp specific things, and they are offering more as a collection. So just keep that in mind easy trade so my next trade I'm gonna go ahead and buy a, a tune gold explosion black market um, you never want to spend two keys on a tune a singularity or a solar flare you always want to just do one key an import and maybe a small add-on if you want to just convince this guy okay don't pay two keys for it. you don't you dare pay three obviously okay but a tune you could easily get it Okay, and the nice thing about it, obviously you don't want to resell it because you're gonna get the same thing from someone else. You want to use that as, um, you know, good add to whatever else you want to buy. So on the next trade, I'm gonna go ahead and buy two golden eggs uh, for one key. Uh, golden eggs are kind of dying off at this point, even though they're they're probably be collector's item. Um, I was just buying two eggs for one key. And some people do see the golden egg as one egg is one key. So that's pretty much good add-on with the tune. Okay, so we're doing good business here. Everything's uh, turning out really good. So my next trade is actually the biggest one from our episode. This guy is uh, trading away his mainframe. Uh, please pay attention to the items that I go ahead and provide him. Okay, so I do offer him the two keys, uh, the two eggs. So we could add, up, add that up. That gives us four keys. The tune is worth two keys, okay? That gives us a total of six, and then we have the import, and then we have the lone wolf, okay? Uh, one of the tactics that this guy uses gets me a little worried because I do want the mainframe. I don't want this guy to leave. He tells me one minute. I don't understand what the big deal is, okay? Maybe he's maybe he really just needs a minute, but I get a little scared, so I go ahead and just kind of tack something on, and we're good with our we're good with our trade here, okay? But uh you know that is uh, a tactic you, you could basically you just give the guy time 
uh, to kind of see what he does and he does it on me and I kind of get a little scared and I just you know pretty much just tack something on onto the trade to pretty much seal the deal there but uh, good tactic to you that's just my opinion so this is going to be my last trade of this episode so I don't really want to trade away the mainframe uh, but unfortunately I kind of have to due to the fact I don't have very good items I do have that one car but to go back to pretty much just trading car for another car uh, that gets rather boring pretty frustrating too for me so I decided to sell the mainframe they go for six to eight keys I'm saying them for minimum which is six keys I'm, I'm wanting something extra this guy goes ahead and tax on a non crate very rare I've been very successful with them I do have that one rare avocado I know everybody loves the avocado and uh, I'll go ahead and see if maybe I could get something some more rares and maybe maybe try to get some more non crate very rares but we'll see how this is headed uh, we're on our way to heat wave everything's looking out pretty good so hopefully you enjoyed the video here okay so I almost forgot to tell you what I'm gonna give away in this video uh, I'm gonna give away an electroshock uh, black market gold explosion so all you gotta do is tell me what your favorite black market uh, go explosion in, in the bottom in the comments below uh, make sure you subscribe uh, make sure you tell your friends about my channel okay hopefully you appreciate the video remember there's a big one coming up so stay tuned thanks for watching and god bless you